score. Cut, cut, cut. <laughs> okay, Beavis and Butthead were on another level. Even yeah. back in when they came out in, in what was it, the early 90s? Mm-hmm. Beavis and Butthead came out. Their comedy, if you watch it now, it still stands up. I mean, just the fact that their names are Beavis and Butthead, like just that in and of itself, you know, is like so, it's so out there. They, so it's from 1992 is when it started Mm -hmm. and it ran for eight seasons. And this, this was our generation. Beavis and Butthead was everything. And I'll also have (laughs) And it's Mike Judge. You know, yeah, so this was this was also our introduction to Mike Judge. This is what put him on the map. Everything Mike Judge has done, I have loved. Office Space, Idiocracy, King of the Hill, Silicon Valley, Beavis right, and Butthead. Silicon Valley. So what's exciting about Beavis and Butthead? So he's rebooting it for 2020, and he's going to voice everything, just like he did with the original. But it's got to be drawn by crayons, like the original like, one was. Uh, closed or something. <sighs> I mean, the great thing about Beavis and Butthead is the animation was horrible. Right. You know, the voices were dead on, but the animation was sucked. (laughs) Yeah. And it's got to be that same thing. I know, it definitely will be. But the question is, so we don't know what the storyline is going to be. Mike Judge says he's going to update it for 2020 so that it'll be like, you know, obviously they'll have cell phones and they'll play video games and they'll do stuff that, you know, we didn't have yet in, in 1992, you know, like Xbox or whatever. Will they be um, married? Will they have kids? Well, well, that's the question, you know. So are they going to be teenagers now or are they going to be adults and their kids are teenagers? We don't know what the storyline is yet. If Beavis and Butthead were real people in 1992, I'm an assistant yeah. manager, sir. they would still be living with their parents. With? <sighs> That's true. Yes, I'm trying to ask a very and, and, they never got to score. Are your shakes no, so shake they would still live with their parents. They would still watch TV uh, in their parents' house, and they would still work at, at, at the burger shop. Yeah. Maybe that's the storyline. Hey, you, you know, that they're going to they have their own question. kids and their own family, but they're no, still living in their parents' home. <laughs> 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 I said, I was like, you know, if, if Beavis comes in as Cornholio and he starts going, I need some TP for my bunghole, <laughs> then the answer has to be, it's 2020. We don't have TP. Are you threatening me? <laughs> <laughs> I am Cornholio. Come on, Beavis. Take <laughs> He's seat. Cornholio. Now, technically, America is not a democracy. Have TV? <laughs> oh, my I bungle? can't wait for 2020 Get Cornholio. Out of here, Beavis. We're very um, fortunate, okay. although, in other parts of the world, they aren't. And I wonder if we're going to see, like, you know, Hank Hill was in it. Remember Hank Hill? That's, yep. that's how we got introduced to him. And Daria. Uh, <laughs> Diarrhea, cha cha cha. Diarrhea, cha cha cha. Diarrhea, cha cha cha. Come on, that's awesome. And, you know, here's the funny thing. I wonder if, remember, this is totally our generation. So our generation gave birth to Gen Z. Like, that's like the youngest kids right now are. The ones that he's going to be targeting. Mm-hmm. I wonder if they're going to understand their parents better, or if they're going to be like, "You guys are so immature." <laughs> Diarrhea, cha cha cha. <laughs> Diarrhea, cha cha cha. But are they going to be able to get away with stuff like that? Yes. I, it, is that too far over the edge? Are people going to complain about it? Uh, you know what? Let them complain. It's Beavis and Butthead. Sorry, snowflakes. Uh, they're going to complain though. That's the thing. Diarrhea, cha cha cha. <laughs> Diarrhea, cha cha cha. You do not want to face the wrath of my bunghole. <laughs> <laughs> complain all you want. He's putting it out there. The people are going to complain. That's the thing. You can see it coming already. <laughs> I am Cornholio. <laughs> I need TV for my bunghole. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can I can see it now. But I am I am one hundred percent in. Why do I not use TP for my pee? <laughs> <laughs> I am so there. We're going to be showing our kids, like, kids, this is what we grew up watching. This is why we have no empathy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just think now, even if you call a kid butthead, people are going to complain. They complain about everything. Okay, let them complain. I don't think Mike Judge cares about that. You know, I think I think Mike Judge is going to do what he's going to do. And you know what? Don't watch it. <laughs> and it's going to be on Comedy Central. So it's not going to be on MTV. Right. Comedy Central and two seasons. He's putting out two seasons right from the very beginning. Remember you asked me how television, how Hollywood is going to be uh, negotiating, getting back on set and, and getting back on television and making money again? Mm-hmm. 
I told you animation was going to be one of the ways. And here's what, you know, I love it. Like I'm looking on Twitter right now. Somebody's asking, like, who is this for? Who is it for? Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's for America. Entire- it's for America. <laughs> it's for America. People with eyes. <laughs> That's who it's for. We need yeah. this in our lives right now. Watch with this. everything going on, we need this. Yeah.